Welcome back to Hardcore. It's officially October, the spooky month, so this episode there's going to be some totally really scary jump scares. I also want to thank everyone for watching the first fire only video. I'm glad so many people enjoyed it. I won't take up more of your time here, so let's just get into it. First things first, I had enough standard tickets to probably hit soft pity, so I do some standard pulls. Who am I hoping for? I mean, Luca would be nice. Well, it was kind of Luca. Oh! Okay. Alright, I expect that. I did not think we'd get the back to back. Wait, okay, next uh, Dunpole. That is no five star. Alright, not exactly what I wanted, but. Alright, and last one. This one should absolutely be the five star. Yep. Alright. Come on, Bailu. Come on, healer lady. I saw abundance and then I saw Bailu and I thought no <laughs> no <laughs> well we did kind of get Bailu anyway I have to get all my characters race enough to tackle Apoc Shadow so it's time to get farming Divergent Universe was about to expire, so I went in real quick, did my run to farm some planner ornaments. Divergent Universe is usually pretty safe, so I didn't even bother recording the run. Just know that it was not a lucky run, and ended up performing really poorly. Despite that, I wanted some ornaments, and have yet to have such a weak run that I struggle on these bosses, yet when I went to fight Yanqing, If you can't take care of either him or his swords quickly, it's a recipe for disaster. And Lynx's turn was too late to heal at all. On the plus side, we do keep Zhao Cho and Lynx safe, but oh, this loss hurts so, so bad. Moza is such an incredible character, and Sampa was going to be my main DPS in the Fantilia fight. Worst of all is all the time and energy I put into both of them, just to have them taken away due to my own dumb mistake. Nevertheless, we move forward. The current banner has two 4-star characters I haven't acquired yet, Gwyn Ifen and Misha, and Link Sha is a very potent healer. All I have to do to get back on my feet is win the 50-50, right? Getting a good amount of Gwynai Fens would serve us as well, for a potential Acheron team when she reruns. Unfortunately, unless someone comes along that does the same thing as Harmony Trailblazer, Super Break isn't really an option for me, considering if Trailblazer goes down, the account will just end. So if we get Lingsha, it'll be a crit Lingsha for me.
Comment down below if you predicted that Japard jump scare earlier was foreshadowing. While Japard is for sure a valuable pickup, I just wanted Ling Sha. You know, just to make me feel better. Japard is a great character to pick up though. He has an inbuilt self revive, which we hopefully won't have to rely on, and we finally have access to shields. And we picked up four copies of Guinai Fen on the way, so there's no harm there. Now to finish leveling the rest of who we have. Real quick, I'd like to ask that if you're enjoying this video, please subscribe. More than 95% of people who watch my videos aren't subscribed, and it really helps my channel grow. My goal is to keep making fun videos, and any support counts. All in all, I estimate that I went through around 5,000 stamina. It landed me at Trailblaze level 58, which means pretty soon I'll be going through this again at Trailblaze level 60. But finally, my teams are ready, and we can take on Apocalyptic Shadow. With this. So, for the first half, we're up against Aventurine, who I didn't really have very good weakness break on. A side effect of Sampo dying, unfortunately. Get a little bit of healing out. Okay, nice. Alright, this puts us above. Alright. That's is unfortunate. Oh, that's a choice. I could have done so much weakness damage with that. Alright. I'm not really going for action value right now because I need to make sure that I can actually, like, come out of this alive. Okay. It's not the hugest deal ever. Let's skill. Okay, we're good. Ugh. Oof. Not... Not great. On the other hand, for Fantilia, we actually have very good weakness break. But I do play things a little too safe. Does too safe exist for an account like this? I'm not so sure. Since you're already here, why 
why not have a meal with it? Ephemeral. Okay. Give me a shield. We're also going to use um with Queen Eye Fan Salt. Okay, I could not cleanse it. Probably should have waited till after this move. Oh, I didn't break the shield, we're fine. Great times to get ults. Uh-oh. Oh, this is this is bad, this is bad. Okay. Uh we skill. Oh okay. Shield. Oh, we got all of them. Nice. Oh, this this is such a bad run, but it was I was playing safely, right? Hmm. Yeah. Only two stars. Well, there's Apocalyptic Shadow on the hardcore account. I'll optimize the run for sure, that'll likely be its own short like 3 to 4 minute video, but if you're still here, thanks for watching until the end. If you're interested in where this series goes, make sure to subscribe. Square formation.